you can put some headlines on the board tomorrow. How do the newspapers look after game five? Look out, the champs are coming, the champs are coming. Cardinals retreat. What does that mean? It means the Cardinals are going back to defend their crowd. Okay. All right. But well, I don't want to plagiarize, but the Carroll's Chronicles, Lynn Sanity. Lance Lynn will dominate tonight. That is wow. original like crazy. <laughs> I've never heard that. Never heard of that. <laughs> Press, you see it, no trouble with the curve. The Cardinals go back for an 06 rematch with the Detroit Tigers. It's going to be fun. Here's a look at the starting lineup for the Giants, brought to you by Taco Bell. Sometimes you got to live Moss. Angel Pagan leads off in center. Marco Scudero. Bat second at second. Pablo Sandoval hits third. Buster Posey back in that cleanup spot. Hunter Pence back in that number five spot. Then it's Brandon Belt, Gregor Blanco in left. Brandon Crawford is the shortstop batting eighth. And then Barry Zito. Here's the right-hander, Lance Lynn. There are the numbers this postseason. Bruce Pochi, Pagan with a 1-0 pitch. Right at Descalso. 1-0. Getting the ball tonight for Mike Matheny. That's chopped to Cosmo. Two up. One two from Lance Lynn. A good start for St. Louis and the young right-hander. Now for the Cardinals. Their starting lineup for this game five brought to you by Taco Bell. Sometimes you've got to live Moss. John Jay leads off in center. Carlos Beltran in right. Matt Holliday in left. Alan Craig. He's hit three home runs in his career against Zito cleans up. Yadier Molina, the catcher. David Fries at third. Daniel Descalso at second. Pete Cosma hitting eighth. And Lance Lynn pitching and batting ninth. Lynn had a perfect first inning, and there's the only start for Zito this postseason. He could not get through three. 34 year old left hander. Jay flies one into left. Back is Blanco. One out. Beltron rounds two and through the left side. There goes Beltron. A swing and a miss struck him out, and Beltron, bad knee and all, steals second. He's there with two out. Need a good one tonight from Zito. Craig shatters his back, and that's caught by Sandoval. That ends the first inning the ball off his right big toe earlier we go to the second in game five hitting under 200 during the postseason he strikes out one away framed by Molina one two pitch that's three strikeouts in a row and two out here in the second is Lance Lynn which he does Molina is on. Now seven out of 17 lifetime against Zito. Had two hits in game three, and he lines one into right. That ball falling in a hurry, and down gets away from Pence. Molina will stop at third on a double by David Freeze. A strikeout for out number one. Barry Zito to walk a hitter intentionally than it is most pitchers because he has a tendency to be wild. Out of his starting pitcher, he'll one. Shattered back might be two. Crawford to second out. Got them both. And Barry Zito gets out of the second and third nobody out jam. Blanco takes a leadoff walk. And the Giants have their first base runner of the night. Strikes out, and that's strikeout number five. Second with Pagan on deck. And his bunt is perfect. Sacrifice is good with Molina feeding this Kelso. The 2 1 pitch. Rounded to the right side to Craig. Lance Lynn is off to a very good start. He has struck out five through three. Good job of getting out of trouble last inning. Jay grounds to Scudero. A 3 2. High fly ball to center for Pagan. Zito is doing his part to 3 and 2. A 
last strikeout is the third of the night for Barry Zito. That's a base hit into right. Scudero night after night getting on base and he starts the fourth to Scudero. And now another one for Sandoval. Scudero will hold it second. It's two on nobody out. One out and a wicked pitch from Lance Lynn for strikeout number six. Jump to Lynn to second. Bad throw hits the back. Coming to score is Scudero, going to third is Sandoval, and the Giants lead one to nothing on a ball that hit the second base bag. Why is the shortstop covering on the ball? He's thrown to the shortstop. I think there was a mix-up between Descalso and Cosma. So now first and third, one out, and here's a little floater to second off the bat. Of Brandon Belt caught by this Kelso two out. That's ball four, and that'll load him up. Up the middle, a base hit. Two runs are going to score as Brandon Crawford delivers. Hence followed Sandoval, and it's a three run fourth inning for the Giants here in the fourth. A little bunt down the third baseline. Great play. And safe. Another run for the Giants. Cito on with a bunt base hit for an RBI. And it's 4-0 San Francisco here in the fourth. And that's it. Lynn cannot again get through four. With the departure and the injury to Jaime Garcia for St. Louis. Pagan on one and two. Strikes out. But not before the Giants get that big inning they've been waiting for. Pitchers covering first. Here's a 2-1. It is hit fair down the left field line. Alan Craig will cruise into second with a leadoff double. Molina reaches out and hits it back to Zito, who makes the play at first. Molina, under a third one out, the 0-2 pitch. Line drive caught. Number two. Leonard third, two out. This Calso grounds to second. Zito gets around the leadoff double. Huge inning for Zito. Barry Zito drove in a run in the top of the inning. Kelly missed with ball one, and now a one hopper to freeze. Fair ball. One out. Into center, and that ball is caught. That hung up a long time. He's been in the bullpen, not just during the regular season. Base hit into left by Posey. But to start this postseason, it went over the Rangers. Here's a 1 0 pitch. Pence. Chopper to the right side. This Council flips for the out. And a scoreless fifth inning put on the board by Joe Kelly. Bottom into the top of the lineup, John Jay. 4 0 Giants. And a pop up into right. Long run. This ball is caught by Hunter Pence. Oh, what a play! Until the last minute that he was going to make the play and did. Digging up turf along the way. And trapping it almost against his wrist. Yeah. In the heel of the glove, the right hand comes in to secure it. I think it may have hit his right hand first. Cardinals batting down by four and a ground ball right side. Scooter a one a play. Two out. Just wide to left. He's grounded to second. Sticks the bat out. Checks on Sandoval. What a job by Barry Zito. It's fouled off to the right. The count 0 and 2. 3 2 pitch. In for strike three. One away. Here's the 0 2. Struck him out. Two down. Great week one win against the Saints. That's strike three. And Rosenthal shows just how good he is. Here's another 1 2 and a strikeout. Strikeout number four. 
every day in spring training, working on his mechanics, different drills. Brian Sabian, the general manager, is saying much the same, that Zito has great intestinal fortitude, never complained during all of his struggles. In a very quiet ballpark. Into center, that ball is caught by Pagan. For the San Francisco Giants, in support of the left-hander, Barry Zito. How good has Zito been tonight? In the hole 0 2, Rosenthal has struck out the first four batters he's faced. Here's the 0 2. Popped up on the infield for Freeze. Two out. Fastball, ground ball, Cosma into his left. Another 1 2 3 inning for Trevor Rosenthal. Bottom of the seventh. Even been a consideration yet. To the shortstop, that's Crawford. One away. Here is a 2 0 pitch. Fly ball into center. Pagan broke back. Now comes in a few. That is out number two. What a night for Barry Zito. With two away, this council lines one into right. That ball is down for a hit. There he goes. 3 2 pitch, and he struck him out. Cosma goes down swinging. And if that is the last pitch of the night for Barry Zito, it gave him five strikeouts in seven shutout innings as to start the fourth inning. 3 2. His hammer down the right field line into the corner. It is gone. Home run, Pablo Sandoval, and it's 5 0 Giants here in the eighth. He homered last night, he homers tonight. That National League pitchers try to pitch him up and in, and he cleared that front side, and I mean hammered it. That ball was off the plate inside. And the Giants are having fun tonight. On a Friday night in St. Louis, as Boggs deals Cosma on the end of that ground ball, gets it over to first. Here's a 2 2 pitch. Two out. The 2 2 pitch is outside a two out walk. There goes Bell. Got a great jump and no throw by Molina. Stolen base for Brandon Bell. There is a game six. Here comes a 1 1. Popped in the air to left. Holiday going back on the move. He's got to end the inning. And a nice running catch by Matt Holliday to end the top of the eighth. The 2 2. A strikeout starts the eighth. Team in LCS history. Come back from down three games to one. That's a fair ball. Bell looked back at the umpire as Jay is on with one out here in the eighth. Ball into right center field will slice to pass, and maybe Zito will get another hitter. Two out in the inning, and maybe he won't. 115 pitches tonight, the highest pitch count of the season for Barry Zito, and all the infielders go in to pat Zito on the chest and say thank you for the job tonight. Three good defensive plays behind Barry tonight and what a job by Barry Zito. And even Cardinal fans appreciate that effort by number 75. Casilla coming in with two out the bottom of the eight. Pitches that gets him through seven and two thirds no runs on six hits. Didn't know it. What Zito did to him tonight. Now Holiday strikes out for the third time tonight. Casilla comes in and strikes out Matt Holiday. Brandon Crawford starts the ninth inning with a line drive into right. Right at Beltron. One pitch one out. Mujica takes over. A loud out. Starts the top of the ninth inning and the batter will be Aubrey Huff. Here's a one two to Huff. 
Reaching out for it, grounds to Discalso. Two out. He's been a consistent performer this postseason for the Giants, but a hitless game five as he lines out to Discalso. Sandoval out of the ball game and Sergio Romo, who we had a chance to visit with before tonight's game, and is one of the most. Romo. Line drive caught. Scooter out to his left. One out. With one out. Line drive base hit to left off the bat of Molina, who's two for four tonight. The 2 2. A strikeout for out number two. Sergio was drafted by the Giants. Got to talk to his grandfather and said, We're going to have to. So. Fly ball into left. Blanco is there, and the Giants have won game five and forced game six on Sunday night. And the first guy leading the charge out of the dugout is the left handed starter, Barry Zito, who goes seven and two thirds, allows six hits. And did not allow a run. More than what the Giants could have asked this evening. A three hour, three minute game and a five nothing win for San Francisco in game five.